Hello there, wonderful people, and welcome back to the Diophil Chronicles. Actually, make that Chronicle. Now that I checked the box properly, it doesn't have an S. Shivat, there's something I've been meaning to ask you. Well, well. So you have some interest in me after all. You previously worked for House Redditch and occasionally associated with bandits. How did you come to be so well versed in ancient sorcery? I wouldn't say I'm well versed. I only picked it up because I thought it would put food in my belly. It's no different to how knights and mercenaries train in order to make a living. That makes sense. Could you tell me more about your experience of working for House Redditch? Well, I had hoped it would help me develop my ancient sorcery skills, to be honest. Their daughter was conducting research into it after all, but I soon gave up on the idea. You see, the strain of sorcery she was researching is uh, as dark as it comes. Excuse me? Oh, is that so? What can you tell me about it? Not much, I'm afraid. Only that it's far beyond my reach. Or rather, that it's something I dare not touch. <laughs> I just realized that you remind me of her. Lady Redditch, that is. What do you mean? Oh, nothing. It's just a feeling, that's all. Wow. No, I think not. You aren't courting, are you, Andreas? <laughs> That's none of your business. Hmm. Sounds like a no. I might consider stepping out with you, if you shared all of your secrets with me. I have no secrets, and no desire to step out with you. <laughs> You're so full of lies. It's part of your charm, though, I suppose. Stop your prattling. If it's marriage you seek, surely your family can find some rich boy for you. Don't be silly. What could be duller than marrying into some prim and proper household? You'd rather have me, would you? You're finally getting it. We fit so well together. <laughs> a secretive man and a woman who can't keep things to herself. You think that's a good match? Ah. So you acknowledge that you do have secrets after all. I was only borrowing your phrase. I was... No. Enough of this. Really? But I was having fun. <laughs> I said... I kept saying it, but I really do love Walter Queen as a character. She's so... <laughs> oh, she's such a mood. Such an interesting combination. <laughs> and totally not what you expect from a prim and proper lady. Also, um... Did, did she just gloss over the fact that her family might be possibly dead? If I recall, they never found her parents, right? Or were the Reddish family, not her actual family, and she's... And that they were her cover family or something. Honestly, it wouldn't surprise me at this point. But but anyway, Eastfield engagement. Engage Imperial Vanguard has what? Oh, okay, I missed that. Engage Imperial Vanguard has attacked the harbor. They are out on a limb and should be easily dealt with. Teach Empire a lesson. That gives me one warning bells. An army won't just send a week, a weekend troop to attack a harbor because normally harbors are priority targets, which also makes them really good decoys or distractions. The problem is it works both ways. Hmm. 
We have received word that hostilities have broken out at Tagaria. The Empire attempted to break through our fleet off the Tagarian coast in order to make landfall at the naval base. Fortunately, Prince Ivangar's elite squad was able to hold the line and push the Empire back. Currently, the naval battle is in a deadlock, though it does seem that some Imperial units have made it ashore. We too are to answer the Kingdom's call. Ready up and depart for the base. We've finally been called up. I never imagined we'd be fighting in a full-scale war. Ultimately, your main objective is to assist the army. You are to provide reinforcements for the front line. En route to the base, however, you will also need to defeat units headed in this direction. You will take the Jacquerite Highway from Central Field towards Tagaria. Expect to encounter the Wyvern Riders gathered near Bald Great Bridge at some point. Hmm? Wyvern Riders? They are knights mounted on winged creatures, Wyverns, who nimbly attack from above. I believe that is a job for your bow and arrows, Iska. The Blue Foxes are counting on you. Now more than ever. Not a thought that brings me joy. Well, the way I see it, the war looks bleak. Especially if we're being called up to fight. Look at it this way. This is a rare opportunity to show what we can do. You have such a yearning for war. I can't comprehend it. Enough, Iska. We're to make for Eastfield at once. The Imperial's weapons look totally different to our own. They must not be let through, lest our presence be for naught. We shall not buckle. Not a man shall get past. The stench of gunpowder and roar of cannon fire. It really feels like war. Stay focused, Quinn, or you'll end up on the floor. My focus is not in question. My every sense is honed. Now, let us begin. Let's see, who should I use? Oh! Let's see, complete the mission within 6 minutes, allow no allies to fall. being wyverns they're somewhat weak to magic or at least susceptible to it to a degree at least i'm hoping that's the case hmm. i've got it Here goes. <laughs> You're not going anywhere. Long live the Empire! On my way. Got it. Target Long eliminated. Live Understood. The Empire! Ouch. On my way. Long live the Empire! Right away. Hmm. 
This isn't really my style. I understand. I'm off! Here goes. Next Long time. Long live the Empire! Target Long in the middle. I've got the it. Empire. Another Long one down. The All according to plan. The enemy continues to advance. Brace yourselves. Do not let them reach central field. So this is when things start getting a bit tougher. Let's see, they're all knights with infantry. Oh wait. Oh wait, I have a summon already. Thank you, time stops when I'm doing this, because it allows me time to think properly. Should I use the summon to murder the crap out of them? Or maybe... Let's see, they're both at an equal distance. So I think... Right so! The good idea here would be to do this. You're not allowed to die without a fight. I'm off. Righto. Here goes. Anywhere, men in position, fire. Just all the way here. That's nice to know. Be gone with you. Long live the Empire! Go Long ahead. live Enemy the down. Empire! Got it. On my way. The king's men are putting up a fight. It seems my comrades need me. That's a wyvern rider. Watch out, everyone. Wait. They're approaching on foot as well. Hmm. We'll have to split up then. Do not let them get past. Yes, yes. There's no need to keep repeating yourself. <laughs> Yeah, I think taking care I of the bottom would be the smarter idea. Got it. Right away. Here goes. Anywhere. Long live the Empire! 
I won't miss. I'm off. Target Long eliminated. Live the Empire! Right away. It's been a mere That's scratch. That's all you got! Ow! I've got it. I can't take any more. You're not going anywhere. I won't miss. Is that all you have? I understand. Next Long time. Long live the Empire! Understood. You're not messing around. Here goes. Fall into ranks. I will perform a magical ritual. Next Long time. Live the Empire! I'm off. Be gone with you. On my way. Understood. I've got it. Okay, I'm gonna right have away. her help you because it seems like a cat is about to get blown up. The rate this is going. This isn't really my style. I won't miss. Understood. On my way. Got it. On my way. Understood. Here I come! I've got it. I understand. Right away. Understood. I won't miss. Oh, no, they just no, don't get the Oh, I actually. Oh, crap, I didn't get the treasure chest. I didn't even see one, if I'm going to be frank. Um. Oh well, I'll just do this again. I'm surprised that only took three minutes, honestly. I thought I went over the six minute mark. Ah. I have achieved a greater grasp of my art. Well, well. What is it, Izzy? 
Have a look at the saddle. It's broken now, but is this how they control the wyverns? That's jade. Not too dissimilar to the pure stuff we came across recently. The jade we recovered from Hattie, you mean? This is a little duller, but I can see the similarity. It doesn't seem that ordinary jade would activate the saddle. You know, I think this might have been what they used to incite the demi-human's rampage. You wouldn't need to know any ancient sorcery to use this, right, Rius? No. Hmm. What is it, Izzy? It's usually impossible to get a demi-human or a monster to obey you. This changes everything. I'd be grateful if you kept this discovery to yourself, Izzy. Oh. All right. Hello there. In any case... Naturally. I. Or, how about... That's why we must. Interesting. Yolden outskirts or Fombrea region. So Iskarian has the highest amount. Uh, let's see here. Donovar or Frederick? I mean Frederick, not Frederick. I'm just so used to the name Frederick. Understood. I'll clear a path. Understood. Be gone with you. Yes, yes, I'm going. Understood. Yes, yes, I'm going. Understood. I've got it. I won't miss.
Yes, yes, I'm going. Understood. On my way. Got it. Seize victory! <clears throat> Understood. On my way. Got it. Understood. Yes, yes, I'm going. On my way. <sighs> Very well. Understood. I won't miss. Got it. I've got it. Be gone with you. Next target. Got it. Understood. On my way. Yes, yes, I'm going. Understood. I've got it. Very well. I'll clear a path. <sighs> Understood. I won't miss. Got it. Be gone with you. <clears throat> Target eliminated. I knew it. I had an inkling that on my way might happen. I've got it. Understood. You're not going anywhere. Kindly freeze in place. Think you can escape? You lightweights can't hurt oh. me. Okay. I got it. Understood. Got it. You lightweights can't hurt me. On my way. Form ranks. Form I forgot there was a barrel attack. right in front of me. <laughs> oh boy. I won't miss. Here goes. <laughs> Hurry up and die. I've got it. I can but a mere scratch. stand. Be gone with you. I won't miss. Understood. We'll hold them here. Very well. Understood. Very well. Yes, yes, I'm going. I won't miss. 
I've got it. Understood. <laughs> Be gone with you. I won't miss. I've got it. Be gone with you. Target eliminated. I've gotten decent, huh? Got it. <laughs> there should be enough. Okay, no, it blows up way too fast, apparently. Shite. Yes, yes, I'm going. Understood. Seize victory! Understood. Here goes. Dang. Yes, yes, I'm going. Understood. Target eliminated. Yes, yes, I'm going. On my way. Next target. Got it. Yet another foe defeated. Moving out. You're not allowed to die without a fight. All right, come here. On my way. Deploying for battle.
Kaboom. Got it. Enemy eliminated. Here I come. Understood. The enemy has been eliminated. Yes, yes, I'm going. Understood. On my way. Yes, yes, I'm going. Form ranks! Forward! Back, you curs. Understood. Here goes. Enemy unit. Very well. Taken down. Target eliminated. Understood. Got it. The enemy unit has been eliminated. Moving out. We're gonna try and go for a pin seer attack. Deploying for battle. Got it. On my way. Got it. You're not allowed to die without a fight. I won't miss. Moving out. I'm going. Moving out. Understood. Deploying for battle. Yes, yes, I'm going. And die. Got it. Very well. Here I come. Deploying for battle. Understood. Target eliminated. Moving out. I'll clear a path. Deploying for battle. Yes, yes, I'm going. Ah! Here goes. Another foe defeated. Be gone with you. Target eliminated. Be gone with you. Next target.
I've learned some new tricks. That went surprisingly well. Lorraine, what news from the front? Reports state that royal forces temporarily repelled the Imperial advance, forcing them to retreat to the Eastern Sea. Since then, however, they have headed north and are making landfall once more near Nonda. Nonda? But that area is surrounded by precipitous cracks. An army could never pass through there. Nevertheless, they are finding a way to cross the range. By what means, though? I have yet to confirm. All that can be ascertained is that they now appear to be marching southward from the heart of the Nondoran Mountains. Prince Ivangar anticipated their movements and mobilized 8,000 of his own elite fighters. They intercepted the invaders in the foothills of the Nondorans. So far, the Empire's weaponry and discipline means they hold out despite inferior numbers. Of course, Ivangar's troops are the best in the kingdom, and the terrain is favorable. But... But... Is it something that ought to concern us? Scouts have reported that further Imperial reinforcements are en route to Tagaria. That means the naval base is at risk of capture. The garrison there would be easily overrun if the Empire attacked, as it now only consists of a few remaining guards and mercenaries. If the port falls, Ivangar's troops would be left vulnerable. The Empire would crush them. Of that there is no doubt. This is no mere coincidence. It must have been their intent all along. Then it's up to us to deal with the Imperial reinforcements. Duke Hende has issued no such order. The Blue Foxes are currently on standby. However, needs must at times like these. If we do nothing, Lord Ivangar could meet his end. But even if we were to overcome the reinforcements, there's no guarantee of victory. We must have faith in our Prince Iska and concentrate on doing our part. Let's go! Imperial troops appear to be gathering at the harbor. Their aim is to break our lines, but we will stand firm to the bitter end. We will be at a disadvantage if they force us into defensive maneuvers. We ought to try using nearby structures and terrain to our advantage. Defense alone will not win the day, though. Remember to attack as well. Don't worry. I'll heal you if I see you're at death's door.
Understood. Got it. Here goes. Long live the Next time. Wow, that was that was really Got it. effective. We're not Long done yet. Live the Empire. They attack from the sides. Yes, yes, they can. On my way. It's been a mere scratch. Men in position. Fire. <laughs> Fall back into ranks. Get ready. Long You're no fun. Live the Empire. Here goes. Long Target eliminated. Next target. Enemy down. Another one down. Got it. All according to enemy down. Got it. Oh, magnificent the reinforcements. Of course. Enemy soldiers are streaming in from a new landing craft. They just don't stop coming. A most amusing spectacle. Seriously? It's at times like this, but I'm glad we have you, Quinn. Indeed. Now let's move. Got it. Let's get going. On my way. You're not messing around. This isn't really my style. I've got it. Got it. Understood. Here goes. That you're all gathered together. I sincerely hope you enjoy this. Think you can escape? No, you're not fun. I won't miss. Target Long eliminated. Right away. Was that an attack? Or Is that all you have? Let's get going. I understand. Got it. Target Long eliminated. Right away. The Got it. Let's get going. It's been a mere scratch. On my way. Got it. Oh, Long they just died. The Empire. Defenses have been breached. What are those black things in the sky? Blue foxes, our next target to the airborne enemies. Do not let a single one through. Coming from this side. On my way. This is bad. Yes, yes, it I is. I understand. Right away. Got it. And it's been a mere scratch. 
I won't miss. You're not allowed to die without a fight. Got it. I understand. Right away, you did I owe? Ah! You got me. What? Excuse me? What? Be gone with you. Seriously? She got pushed back into the range somehow. Oh no, don't let her have you. You wait ah. and got it. It was about time. Ugh. I've got it. Fall back into ranks. Is that all you Get have? Ready. I understand. Here goes. Wait. Oh, come on. I am. Why are you on the ground? Thank you very much. Men! In position! Fire! Be gone with you. Long live the Empire! Enemy down. Right away. Ah. I understand. Was that an attack? Or Understood. A Is fight? that all you have? Right away. You Next don't time. Long live the Got it. Empire! Understood. Target Long eliminated. Right away. I understand. I've got it. Let's get going. Next Long time. This is bad. Understood. The I won't miss. You're not allowed to die without a fight. Be gone with you. Long live Target the eliminated. I just realized I think I missed a treasure chest again. Ah crud. Haha! <laughs> I grow ever more powerful. The Empire's first invasion attempt appears to have been unsuccessful. A mercenary unit known as the Blue Foxes, stopping their reinforcements from coming ashore. The main conflict, however, takes place in the north, where Ivangar and Zavatian's armies clash violently. Zavatian and Ivangar engage in single combat, but the prince's fearless onslaught is easily repelled. At last, a fateful bullet pierces the prince's chest, and as his life is snuffed out, so too is the morale of his army. With the now leaderless Alitanians in complete disarray, Zavatian's forces press their advantage and march south. Word of this spreads quickly through the royal ranks. And before long, the entire army is ordered to retreat from Eastfield. The order also applies to the Blue Foxes, despite their victory. Thus, the Alitanian army was defeated by the Empire. Having secured Tagaria, however, the Imperial forces halt their advance and set up camp. Meanwhile, the citizens of Alitane fall into despair. Their prince is dead, and the shores of their island breached for the first time in centuries, seeking succor in their time of despair. They come to lean 
upon the Granville Church. My first ever encounter with Levantia Shatham was certainly a vivid one. On the day I was assigned to be his chamberlain, he introduced himself to me not as a prince, as one would expect, but as an equal. He had a calm smile and exuded wisdom that belied his young age. One day, it was decided that Levantia would be sent to House Leicester, whose head, Arlim, was a close ally of the king. A decision made in secret. Among the bustling activity surrounding the prince, an air of uneasiness had started to brew. He seemed aware of it, yet as we spoke in the carriage to Leicestershire, there wasn't a hint of worry in his voice, nor was there the slightest change to his smile. My fears must have been plain to see. He gave me a beaming grin, as if to cheer me up. As we came to a halt, I hurried out to open the carriage door. Levantia alighted with his usual grace, and then, bursting out of the front doors of the manor, came a young boy grinning from ear to ear. He had this lively look to him, brimming with a curiosity for all things. He briskly approached us and exchanged introductions with Levantia. There was a youthful warmth to his voice that assured me that he bore no malice, and I began to feel at ease. Having already become fast friends, the two then turned to me and called me over. Even today, I can't explain my feelings in that moment. Ashes and glory. After capturing Tagaria, the Empire's relentless progress appears to have temporarily abated. Alas, this does little to assuage Alitanian fears, and they begin to seek refuge in religion. In response to this demand, the Granville Church carries out its activities with increased vigor. Among its new initiatives is a promise to rescue a number of children from Westfield. They were orphaned following a disaster in the barren lands of Baladin Wilds and left to fend for themselves. The church enlists the Blue Foxes to rescue the orphans and bring them to safety. Listen! <laughs> they couldn't have! Of course. Yeah. That's why. That's right. There we go! Thanks. Oh no! Escort mission! That's a lot to do. Mm. Yeah, I'll decide which side quest to prioritize. But then again, I'm just gonna do them all, so there's not really any prioritizing per se that's going to happen. <laughs> anyway, thank you very much for watching. I sincerely hope you enjoyed the Diofield Chronicle. I sincerely hope you'll consider giving me your viewership again in the future sometime! And with... Honestly, I kind of expected the whole... 
the whole fall of the castle thing. I mean, it's it was literally in the title card, title name. So I suppose it shouldn't come as a shock, but wow. That escalation. <laughs> you think Prince Zivar would have become a main character or something, or at least a focal point for half the game holding off the troops before everything goes to hell. But nah, <laughs> it just immediately escalates already. So, with that as our ending note, I bid you all fun. Bye!